Montreal, Canada hosts round seven of the F1 World Championship. The team's flying across the Atlantic for the first time this season. The famed circuit Gilles Villeneuve is on the Ile Notre Dame in the St. Lawrence Seaway. The island hosting World Expo 1967 and the rowing and canoeing events at the 1976 Montreal Olympic Games. The track is, of course, named after one of the nation's late, much-loved sons, one of the greatest racing drivers never to win a world title, Gilles Villeneuve. His 1979 French Grand Prix battle with René Arnoux, one of the sport's most legendary stouches. He remains the only Canadian to win his home Grand Prix, taking victory for Ferrari in 1978, his first full season with the Scuderia. But his legacy lives on at the circuit, which spends most of the year frozen as a winter wonderland covered in snow and ice. The Montreal track is Canada's third Formula One venue, following its debut on the calendar in 1967. Former hosts Mossport Park and Montreblanc sharing the duties until 1978. Michael Schumacher remains the most successful driver at the track with seven wins, one for Benetton and six for Ferrari. Three consecutive from 2002 to 2004 during his golden years in the sport. But Lewis Hamilton is snapping at the Germans' heels with five, including the last two. Fellow three-time world champion Nelson Piquet has three, while it's two for Ix, Stewart, Jones and Senna. This year is also the 10th anniversary of Hamilton's emotional first win, his maiden victory in the sport with McLaren in 2007. The Brit loves the track and will be wanting to stretch his legs after Ferrari dominated Monaco. Other maiden wins at the track include Jean Alesi, whose only F1 victory came for Ferrari in 1995, and Red Bull Racing's Daniel Ricciardo in 2014. Montreal, even before my win, I, I really enjoyed that track. Just like Monaco, Pirelli will bring the softest compounds of its range with the soft, super soft and ultra softs. But Montreal will be much harder on the tyres, with the track very hard on brakes and the cars needing good power and traction out of corners. It also requires patience on setup as a street track used once a year. Street circuits create, they're, they're unique. Um, you know, they also change a bit every year because normally a lot of cars and traffic has been on the track. Um, so whether there's oil or there's more bumps or something, you know, the track does change. So that's, that's really cool. You've got to adapt each time. Sebastian Vettel and Ferrari now have the upper hand in the title race. The German 25 points ahead of rival Hamilton, who can't afford to let that gap get any bigger. So the championship chase hangs in the balance in Canada.